What's up everybody? This is MMA. I'm back again with another video. But like I always do before I get started, I want to give a shout out to all the subscribers, all the new subscribers, everybody that's been leaving comments. Like I said, I'm going to get back to y'all with y'all comments. I want to thank everybody for leaving thumbs up. And like always, I can't forget the fucking trolls and the haters. Fuck y'all. And anything that y'all leave for me on the message board, guess what? I'm not a bitch. I'll respond. Now on with the video. This video today is about Rafael Dos Sancho's. I hate to disrespect this dude, but he's a bitch, man. I'm going to tell you why. And Cowboy Donald Cerrone, both calling out Khabib Nurmagomedov for his fight at Fox 19, okay? And if y'all don't know, Tony Ferguson had to pull out from that fight due to some medical complications. It was reported that he had some blood in his lungs. I don't know what that's all about. I just hope him well and wish he gets well so he can get back in the octagon and kick ass like he always do. But anyway, on to the topic here, okay? These guys, RDA and Donald Cowboy Cerrone, got on Twitter basically and called Khabib out and let him know, hey, let's do this, okay? Cowboy wrote saying, hey, I know somebody, you know, that, that wants to fight, you know, hit that himself, you know? But I'm going but I'm I'm to leave him alone for now and I'm going to jump on RDA. But then RDA responds as well and says, hey, basically, buddy, me and you got some unfinished business. You know, I'll be ready in July. And Dana White and y'all, I'm attaching y'all to this to let y'all know that I'm down with this and I want to get this thing rolling. Now, RDA, he is a straight up bitch. How are you calling somebody out when you're fucking injured? And then talking about, oh, I'll, I'll basically I'm ready to fight you. We got unfinished business, but I'll be ready in three months. Shut the fuck up. You ain't ready to fight nobody right now. We talking about Fox 19, which is in like two damn weeks. What the fuck are you responding about? You know, I hate to, I hate to diss people. I hate to diss these fighters, but they always fucking tripping over their own feet, getting on Twitter, becoming Twitter finger gangsters. And I just hate that shit. You know what I mean? Why are you on Twitter basically jumping in a conversation or jumping in something that you can't be a part of? It's like it's like you're looking. It's like you're watching a fight play out, and you're and you're like a fucking instigator. You know, it's almost like you're somebody that's locked up talking about talking to somebody that's out that's out free talking about let's fight. You know, how the fuck are y'all gonna fight? You know, you're injured. You know, shut the fuck up and stay out of it. And then talking about you gonna be ready in July. You think Khabib wants to wait till July to whoop your ass? He 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 wants to whoop your ass right now, and he will whoop your ass. You know, and, and you talking about you right in July, you know damn well you already got a fight lined up in July. Probably the fight, big head, stupid looking ass, um, I don't even know the fuck his name. Somebody hit me up in the comments and let me know that dude's name that he's, he's got to fight. Um, it's the dude that beat Anthony Pettis the last fight. I can't even think of his name because he's a fucking clown too. No disrespect. But somebody hit me up in the comments and let me know what his name is. But basically, RDA, shut the fuck up. You've been talking shit to every fighter lately since your ass has been hurt. You've been talking more shit hurt than you talk when you're when you're healthy. You know, so we all know that you phony as hell. Because guess what? When you're healthy, you humble, you respectful to everybody, and you ain't got shit to say. Especially when Conor McGregor was getting on your ass, you ain't got shit to say in his face. You know, but once your ass get hurt, you got a whole bunch of shit to say on Twitter. So shut the fuck up. You know you can't be Khabib. Khabib ragdolled your ass last time y'all fought. And to me, right now, the only thing different with you is you look like you're more beasted up, you got more muscles on you, and you're a little bit faster. But guess what? That still ain't fast enough to beat Khabib. Because Khabib, when y'all fought, was way faster than you, way fucking stronger than you. And homie, you just need to stay in your lane right now. Now on the Donald Cerrone. I got much respect for Donald Cerrone. He's always willing to fight. And when he fights, he fights, you know. And hey, I respect that, you know. And that would be a good ass fight to see with Donald Cerrone and Khabib. And especially if they can get that fight back on Fox 19. That would be great. But there's one knock against Donald Cerrone. Actually, there's two, okay? Donald Cerrone, the first knock, buddy. Anytime the spotlights is on you, you shrivel up. I don't know what the fuck it is. But when the spotlight is on you, man, you shrivel up like a damn palm tree in the heat in the summertime that ain't being watered. That's what you shrivel up like. And then also, man, for some damn reason, your big, tall, linky ass 
is a slow fucking starter. And that is bad news for fighting somebody like Khabib. Because guess what? Khabib is not a slow starter at all, man. Khabib is fast paced. He throws that overhand right. He grips a hold of your ass, takes you the fuck down. And trust me, Khabib will take you down. Because you, your, your takedown defense is not that great, you know? So the only thing you have your, as far as takedown defense is your damn kicks. Other than that, you're going down. And you as a slow starter, buddy, you will go down fast. Khabib will keep you there and pound your ass out. But I really believe that this will be a good fight. I think both fighters are gritty, grinder fighters, just like how he was going to be with Tony Ferguson. So I, I think this will be a great fight as well to watch, you know? But guess what? Much respect, much props go to Donald Cerrone for calling out Khabib. I hope Khabib and the UFC get together and make this fight happen at Fox 19. RDA, shut your bitch ass up while you on the sideline injured. Because you ain't fighting nobody. And you know you already got an easy ass fight coming up in July. So shut the fuck up. But to the fans, I want to thank y'all for listening. To everybody that's listening right now, subscribe of course. Leave a thumbs up. Hit me up in the comments and let me know who y'all think should fight. Khabib at Fox 19. Also, let me know what y'all think about the video. Until next time, peace out.